In this week's Plan With Me, I'm going to be planning my Target Planner. And I found this printable online. It was actually through a Facebook group called Planners With Manners. And one of the admins, I think, someone in the group posted this freebie. And so I went and printed it on sticker paper. And then I just need to cut it out. Um, I'll put the information down in the description box, but it is, let's see, she says, follow me on Instagram, hedge.hollow. So that's who made this available for everybody. And if you join that Facebook group, you'll be able to get this. But as you know, Monday the 21st is a total solar eclipse. So I thought that this would be perfect to use in this week's spread. These are the three washi that I have picked for this spread. And so I'm just going to go ahead and open up and get started. So I'm going to go ahead and write in the dates for this week. Oh, and this pen is a gold gel pen from the Target Dollar Spot. So there are my dates, and now I'm going to go ahead and begin placing down my washi for the weekend washi banner. And then I can put the weekend sticker that came on that kit, I can put that on top. I'm going to go ahead and start putting this washi down. I kind of feel like just doing it straight across right above Saturday and Sunday this week instead of making the banners that I usually do. I'm going to go all the way across the page. Okay, I've got the washi strips down and now I'm just going to put down the weekend sticker. And then next I'm going to put down this full box here. It says 82117 total solar eclipse. So I'm going to mimic this side with the washi and put these washi strips behind this full box. In these inserts I like to have a quote or a special deco piece on Monday just to kind of have something for motivation for the start of the week. I'm just cutting these straight. I'm not doing a fishtail end or anything this time. Okay, and then now I can put down this full box here. I kind of have to bend the corner to get the backing off. So there's that. And then I have this weekly tracker here. It's got Monday through Sunday down the side. And as you know, these Target inserts don't have a notes section, so I kind of just create my own. And I think I'm just going to use the side of Friday for that, because I still have room to write there. I know that we have an appointment on Thursday, so I'm going to go ahead and put this one down. It's got planets and some stars, so I'm going to put that down on Thursday. And then I have another one. These are both half box sizes. And this one is just a different color scheme, but same pattern. I have an appointment on Wednesday, so I need to mark that with this half box. And then my older sister's birthday is on the 25th. So her favorite color is pink, but the eclipse eclipsed her favorite color. <laughs> I'm using this blue. It's a glitter kind of a quarter box. It's a little bigger than a quarter box and a little smaller than a half box. So I'm going to go ahead and notate her birthday on Friday with this glitter sticker. I'm going to use this one. It's just a washi deco piece that came with the kit. And there are three of them and they each have a different color bow here. And so I think that this will look really cute on top of there to notate her birthday. 
Okay, and then I have some of these. Let me see how many I have. Three of these checklists here. And so we have a light blue, the dark blue, and then the cream color. I want the cream, because I have that cream box over here, I want this cream one to go over here. And then I need a weekend to do, so I'm going to use the light blue one. And because Saturday and Sunday is a shared space on this Target insert, I just put it there, and then I can fill it out for both days there. And then this darker blue, I'm going to put on Tuesday. The cream one will go on Monday. And then I have, let's see, just going through the pieces. So there's a water tracker, there's only one. Maybe I'll just track one day's worth of water. I mean, I have no choice, right? <laughs> so, what will be the lucky day? Maybe Wednesday, we'll track. <laughs> oh, we're going out to eat for my sister's birthday, so this little quarter box here will be perfect. It's got a little fork and a spoon. Oh, there's a TV one, um, dollar bills, and hearts. So, I need to run errands and go, go shopping on Wednesday, so I'm just going to put this money one over here on Wednesday. And then Monday, I'm going to use this heart one. And then the TV one, I'm just going to use that for filming. And I'm going to do that on Tuesday this week. And then I have one more. This one's a glitter quarter box. I'm going to use this one on Thursday. I actually need to run an important errand that day, so that'll help with remembering that. And then I have this quarter box glitter um, weekly tracker. You can see it's got seven of the kind of asterisk stars, which is really cool for an eclipse layout. And so I'm going to put that near my notes section that I created on Friday. And I can track a habit there. I'm going to use this header here. It says to buy. And actually, before I place that header down, she had this notes sidebar sticker here. And I'm actually going to cut this and put it on Wednesday. And then I can fill in... Actually, let me do the bottom for Wednesday. And then I can fill in whatever... Um, special things that I need to add to the grocery list that day. So, stuff that's not the usual things that I need to get. So I'm going to go ahead and stick this down for that. And then now I can put down my to buy header. So I've got this. I'm going to put down the today header on Monday since that is the total eclipse. Um, it'll be kind of cool to use that header for the day of the eclipse. This to-do header, oh and all of these headers are glitter headers so it's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to use this to-do one on Tuesday with that list there. And then little things, I'm also going to put this on Wednesday but I'm going to put it on the other side of Wednesday above this little section and it'll cover up part of Wednesday so I'm going to trim down the header sticker at the top and to even it out just at the bottom there and then I'll just place that down a to clean header I'm going to put that down on Friday I always clean deep clean the bathrooms on Friday. And then don't forget, I want to use this header um, above that quarter box that I placed on Thursday because I need to remember to run an unusual and important errand. Next I have these flags here. So I'm just going to go ahead and, let's see, 
only have five of these. I was going to use it as a date cover, but there are only five of them. Oh no, there's not. One was hiding. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use these as date covers. Yes, I already wrote in the dates, but this is going to be a little bit funner to use. And then I'll just write the dates on top of that except that they don't really fit there. I have to put them on this side. So then that defeats that part. I'll white that out. That's what I'll do. I'll white out the date that I already have down. See, if I would have seen these before, I could have planned this out a little bit better and then it would have looked a little nicer. But sometimes you gotta fly by the seat of your pants. So that's what I'm doing today. And in the end, it all comes together. <laughs> no matter how you do it, there will always be an outcome. I don't know why I'm philosophizing. Philosophizing? Philosophizing? Let's see here, and then I'll put this on Friday. And then one for the shared weekend area. Okay, that one's crooked. Oh well. Oh, look at this. There's a little deco piece of a birthday cake. Perfect for my older sister's birthday. So I'm gonna place that down. And there's a little deco piece of a vacuum. Even I do that on Wednesday, so that goes there. And then I have one laundry sticker from the kit. So I'm going to place that down. Thursday and there is a garbage sticker and that is going on Tuesday and then we have a planner sticker and that is going on Sunday for planning day and then there are a few other deco pieces but the only one I see that I want to use the functional deco is this grocery shopping cart and that'll be on Wednesday, so I'm just going to place that there. And then I have three little of these, <laughs> I have three of these glitter teardrops. I've seen people using these. I'm not quite sure how to use them, but I'm just going to wing it and just place them down. Okay, so those are down, and then I have two more of these bow washi banner thingies. And so I'm just going to put these, I'm going to put one here above the eclipse sticker, and then I'm going to put another one below it. Try to dress it up a little bit more. So there's that, and then in the kit there were some script functional pieces here. So I'm going to, I don't think I need all of these, but, and they're kind of redundant, they're kind of a, the same as the functional pieces that I already put down, but that's okay, you can never have too many reminders, I guess. This one is trash day, that one was grocery run that there, cleaning day. I'm going to put that down on Monday. Laundry day, Thursday, and then planning session. We have happy mail on Tuesday. And then she has two washi strips for you, so I guess I'll try to put these across the top. This one has the phases of the solar eclipse on it, which is cool. I should have put this down before I wrote my dates at the top there. Then it would have fit better. And then I have the rest of this notes 
think I'll just use some of it for over here on Sunday. And then I can make notes for next week. It's always good to have a little section for next week. And since my weekend to do is over here, this should be fine in that space. So I just need to write everything in and my week is all set up. And I hope you have a great week and I'll see you in the next video.